AI is moving in an unimaginable speed. We have an AI that does a smooth lip sync. And this man, dead serious, leans in and whispers, I think I was a raccoon. We have an agent that has the potential to kill our traditional learning system. This AI lets you control the camera movement of video however you want. Unitry Robotics introduced a new model. We have a free and open source text to speech that clone a voice in a zero shot. Then I would never talk to that person about boa constrictors or primeval forests or stars. I would bring myself down to his level. And finally, we have a new and incredible AI from Google and DeepSeek. First up, we have a 3D informed video generator with precise camera control, and it is called Gen 3C by NVIDIA. What makes Gen 3C different from other video generator? It's insane camera control. If you remember, most video generator can perform like one or two common camera movement. But with this, you can specify any kind of camera movement, and it will nail it accurately, as you can see. Here, it moves to left, then right, and comes, then zoom out, and then zoom in. It is crazy that we are able to perform six camera movement in less than 10 second video. You can even input a video and change or edit the camera trajectory to any kind of movement, while also seeing the preview of the result. And the result seems to be perfect. And here is a clip for different kind of camera movements. Here is a drone shot video generated using just five images. The crazy thing is that it is hard to distinguish from a real drone shot video. It seems flawless to me. When I check the availability of Gen 3C, it says the code is coming soon. This means they are going to open source it. For now, I will put the link to the page in description box. Note that to save time, I'm not going through all the examples. I will explain with a few examples and then move on to the next news. Next, Unitree Robotics just unveiled a new model called Unitree DEX5 and its agility is on the next level. If you don't know, Unitree G1 is a very capable robot that can run, do a decent sidekick for a robot and it is the first robot to perform a side flip. But there is one catch, has less agility when it comes to finger movement. But their new DEX5 model agility is trying to catch up to us. I mean, look at its agility. This is an impressive new model from Unitree. Next up, we have the best voice cloner that clones a voice with a reference of a few second clip. And it is called Spark TTS by Spark Audio. What makes it more accurate than any voice cloner is the fact that it uses a large language model called Quen 2.5 of Alibaba. Details are boring. So let's see the samples. Here we have a sample input clip. A chance to leave him alone, but no. She just wanted to see him again. Anna, you don't know how it feels to lose a sister. Anna, I'm sorry, but your father asked me not to tell you anything. As you can hear, her voice sounds sad. Now, let's hear what it sounds like when it reads the middle statements. Dealing with family secrets is never easy. Yet sometimes, omission is a form of protection, intending to safeguard some from the harsh truths. One day, I hope you understand the reasons behind my actions. Until then, Anna, please, bear with me. Wow, I have to say, the voice sounds exactly like the original clip. It even keeps the sad tone well. And what is impressive is it can also clone the voice to read Chinese. Let's play this clip. 处理家庭秘密，从来都不是一件容易的事。然而有时候，隐瞒是一种保护形式，只在保护一些人免受残酷的真相伤害。有一天，我。This is insane because the voice seems the exact voice, even though it is Chinese. It keeps every detail, including the sad tone. Here we have a sample input of Donald Trump. In short, we embarked on a mission to. Make America great again for all Americans. Now, let's hear the cloned voice with this script. We know technology is advancing quickly, but AI is moving even faster. It's already transforming our lives from the way we work and stay connected to how we tackle some of the world's biggest challenges. This is amazing. I mean, if you play this clip to any average Joe, they will totally believe it. I can't blame them. It is too smooth. Now let's hear Trump speaking Chinese version. 我们知道技术发展很快，但人工智能的发展更为迅速，它已经在改变我们的生活，从我们的工作和联系方式到我们。The Chinese version also sounds great. Here we have sampled of Rick from Rick and Morty. 
Yeah, that's the difference between you and me, Morty. I never go back to the carpet store. Note that the sample is only four seconds. Now let's hear the clone TTS. Then I would never talk to that person about boa constrictors or primeval forests or stars. I would bring myself down to his level. As you heard it, it did well with just four second sample audio. Let's hear the Chinese version. You can see that the Chinese sound is very similar to Rick. Now we have Farina from Genshin Impact. After all, I was once the brightest star in all of Fontaine, well versed in all the various performing arts. A mere musical is... Now let's hear if it can clone this high pitch sound. I'm very confident in my singing skills, but there aren't many pieces of music that are worthy of my vocal prowess. I hope the creatives in the theater troupe get their act together and don't keep me waiting in vain. This is awesome. You can see how it cloned her voice and pitch perfectly. But will the voice be accurate for this Chinese script? Let's hear it. <laughs> This is nice. It did well with the voice and its pitch. Hey, we have another character from Genshin Impact. Let's hear the sample voice. Every type of tea is unique. The more you drink, the more you will understand the subtle differences. Smelling the aroma will reveal the quality of the tea. I need to say this voice is perfect for story videos. Anyway, let's hear the cloned voice. They were loyal servants of Liu. They lived through a bitter war and sacrificed much. All of Liyue, from harbor to chasm, is indebted to the Yakshas for their protection over the years. As you heard it did well for this also, let's hear the Chinese voice. I have nothing to say. This is just great. And the good thing is, you can clone not only English voices, but also Chinese voices. Here we have a two-second Chinese voice sample. Let's hear the clone sample. I have to say, this is impressive. For it to clone the voice perfectly, with just two seconds of sample audio, is unbelievable. Let's hear what it sounds like in English. Speech synthesis technology has quietly integrated into our daily lives. From smart voice assistants to audiobooks and even personalized voice cloning, this technology is transforming the way we access information and interact with the world. Moreover, As you heard, that is definitely the exact voice. The good news is this text-to-speech model is free and open source. The requirements for this TTS is a 6GB VRAM or more of NVIDIA GPU and a RAM of 12GB. And, if you don't have a GPU, you must have a powerful CPU with 16GB or more RAM. Anyway, the code and the installation process are out, so I'll leave that page for you in the description box. Moving on, this AI is revolutionary, and it is called Theorem Explain Agent. And from what I've seen, it has the potential to obliterate traditional learning system. What it does is, you give it any kind of theorem to explain, and then, it will go ahead and create an entire video with high-quality voiceover. In short, what I'm saying is, it creates a tutorial video, just for you. Let us see if it is actually good. Here, they made it create an entire video explaining Keldhall method from chemistry. And after seeing the entire video, I was blown away because everything is structured, detailed, and easy to understand. Plus, the animation is great. Look at a video. The acid and catalyst, essential to breaking down organic materials. Next, observe the distillation stage. Here, a round bottom flask connects to a condenser via a curved tube, guiding vapor flow efficiently. This mechanism separates nitrogen compounds from the digest. Finally, the titration stage is presented. The burette. Wow, this is amazing. As you can see, everything is perfect, including the voiceover the animation, and how it explain the chemistry theorem. Note that the video is 5 minutes long, and I'm just showing you the impressive and important part. Here, in the same video, you can see it is good at writing and explaining formula. In this case, using measured volumes and titrant normality, the formula translates into a concrete nitrogen percentage. And this AI also works well at explaining any mathematical theorem.
Here, we have a video of integration by substitution that was generated with this agent, and it keeps explain it. The first step is to identify a substitution. Notice the term x squared plus 1 inside the square root will let u equals x squared plus 1. Next, we compute the derivative of u with respect to x. Since u equals x squared plus 1, its derivative is due equals 2x dx. Notice how this matches the 2x dx term in the original integral. Now, we can rewrite the integral in terms of u. Again, you can see how it simplifies difficult topic like calculus into an easy lesson. And, at the end of the video, it gives us a short summary on the topic like this. Let's go through them one by one. To excel at substitution, keep these practical tips in mind. By the way, the video was almost 8 minutes long. I mean, with this kind of tool, the future of education is going to be totally different. And this tool doesn't just work for chemistry and mathematics, but also for physics and other computer science subjects that are hard to understand. Here, it is explained some topic from computer science. Let us hear it. Where the x-axis represents a parameter and the y-axis represents the loss. And this is not its limit. It can even explain complex topic using simple and cool animation like this. Finds the best fit line by minimizing the sum of squared errors. For logistic regression, gradient descent. I think this is enough examples. But how does it work? Let me break it for you in simple term. Theorem explain agent has two agents. And they are a planner agent and a coding agent. The planner agent takes the input theorem and it understand the theorem. Break down the explanation into logical steps, create a story plan or script, and generate the narration text. It figures out what to explain and in what order. And coding agent takes the plan and narration from the planner, and it translate these into actual Python code using the Manim library, a powerful animation library, to create the visual element of the video, and then it merges it with a high-quality voiceover. Then, you have a full tutorial. And for the planner agent, they tried with a bunch of AI models, but the success rate for overall performance is low on most AI. As you can see here, for overall performance, GPT-40 gets 55%, and Claude 3.5 Sonnet gets below 20. Even for Gemini 2.0, the score is low. I mean, it is understandable, because these are base models. Let's see how bad is the video generated using these models. Next. Let's construct squares on each side of the triangle. The area of the square on the hypotenuse... As you can see, it is a messed up animation. But, thinking model like GPT-03 Mini Medium scores above 90%. So, it works well for reasoning models like DeepSeek R1, Gemini 2.5 Pro, Quen 32B, and Claude 3.7 Thinking. And the great thing about this is that it is free and open source. Anyway. I will leave their GitHub repo in the description box for you guys to check. Next, DeepSeek has just released the new version of DeepSeek V3, which has a major boost in performance compared to the old V3. And in AIM 2024, it scored 59.4, which is almost 20 more points than the old DeepSeek V3. By the way, it also crashes other models like the latest model of OpenAI, GPT 4.5. In fact, the new DeepSeek model is currently the number one non-reasoning model you can use right now. If you want to use the new model, make sure to turn off the DeepThink mode in DeepSeek website or application. Some people are saying that the new V3 model is the base model for the coming DeepSeek R2 reasoning model. There is an article from Reuters that says DeepSeek R2 is going to be released in early May, and it's less than a month away from now. I know it's going to be huge, just like DeepSeek R1. Anyway, I will put the article for you guys to check it out. Moving on, Hedra introduced Character 3. By the way, if you are not familiar with Hedra, it is a character animation tool that allows you to animate your 3D character. Basically, how his work is, first, you give it a photo, and then an audio. After that, it will lip sync the audio naturally while also adding some natural body movements. Let's see some examples. Creating automated lip sync for cartoon characters with AI is just not possible, man. Okay, I got it. And what about animals? No way. The lip sync is just smooth. Note that the video was made using multiple character and basic video editing. 
Now, let me show you a crazy use case of this animation tool. Later we will see how they made it. For now, let's just see the video. Okay, so listen. Right. I just had the most horrible date of my life. Like, I'm still processing what even happened. So I meet this guy, right? Uh -huh. He seemed normal over text, kind of cute in his pics. Huh? But the moment I walk in, I see him sitting there, sweating, like legit drenched. Okay. I'm thinking, okay, maybe he just walked here really fast? No big deal. So I sit down and I kid you not, the first thing he says to me is, do you believe in past lives? Um, what? No way. So I laugh nervously and say, uh, I guess? Why? And this man dead serious, leans in and whispers, I think I was a raccoon. A raccoon. Come on, no effing way. And then, he starts explaining how he has these urges to rummage through trash, and that sometimes he said what? when he sees a dumpster, he just feels something. What the? At this point, I am fighting for my life not to laugh. But then, he reaches into his pocket and pulls out a tiny piece of bread and just How in hell? starts nibbling on it. I lost it. I straight up burst into laughter right in his face, like full-on, ugly cackling. You're making this stuff stop. up. And the worst part? He just nodded like he expected this reaction. Like, yeah, I get that a lot. I grabbed my bag, said, good luck with that, and left. I swear to you, I have never walked out of a date so fast. So yeah, that was my night. Hope y'all are having a better one. I have to say, this is impressive. Being able to create not a typical 5 to 10 second video, but a more than minute long video is impressive. How they create the video is simple. First, they generated images using Google Imagen 3, then enhanced them to high resolution using Topaz Lab. After that, they came to Hydra. They input the image, pasted the script, chose a voiceover, and after creating enough clips with Hydra, they just edited, and that's it. What are your thoughts on the video? Do you think people will know this was made with AI? Anyway, let's see a comparison between Hydra and other models. For generations, I have protected my family's secret. There's no way I'm giving it up now. For generations, I have protected my family's secret. There's no way I'm giving it up now. For generations, I have protected my family's secret. There's no way I'm giving it up now. For generations, I have protected my family's secret. There's no way I'm giving it up now. You can clearly see Hydra is the best compared to the other models. But is Hydra the best character animation tool? The answer is no. OmniHuman 1 beats it in all area. Check this video to know more about OmniHuman 1. Anyway, if you want to try Hydra, they give you a free credit to start with but you have to pay if you want to use it more. You will find Hydra website link in the description box. Lastly, we have currently the best AI from Google, and it's called Gemini 2.5 Pro. And this is their first reasoning model. And this Gemini 2.5 Pro crushes the top model by a big margin. What makes Gemini 2.5 unique is one million context window, which is five times OpenAI and Claude top models. A one million token context window lets an AI process huge amounts of text at once. This means it can read an entire book, follow a very long conversation, or handle a large code base without breaking things into chunks. It keeps track of all the details over long spans, which is especially useful for debugging, improving code, or vide coding. Gemini 2.5 Pro is special because it's a multilingual module. It doesn't just process text, it can process images, videos, audio, and even processing YouTube videos via YouTube links. The awesome thing about this best AI is free, and you can use it right now in Google AI Studio. Just make sure to select Gemini 2.5 Pro. You will find the link down in description box. Which news did you find helpful? And let me know in the comment. So if you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and hitting the bell. Until next time, folks.